I hope it's not super loud or something. <laughs> Earth, 1998. My face is covering that. Oh, okay, that was it. Computer defense initiative, uh, initiative activated. Diplomatic solutions to the world's problems fail and war erupts as some madmen press ahead with their insane something. condition 2087 high concentration of radiation produce random storms and mutations somehow life continues in the wasteland are you gonna say wasteland whoa they said it how did i know why was that that sound was so familiar wasn't it also scared the hell out of me <laughs> oh look how pretty it is wow Oh, this is so nice! My goodness. Okay. Um, America only. Everyone, everything else died. Cheddar cheese font. Hell yes. Okay. Well, I guess. Uh, I guess it's just a new game. The following is an excerpt from the history oh, of the Rangers: The Early Years by Carl Allard, 2087. Allard Press, Ranger Center. Hardbound, page 290. Tensions grew oh. with the coming of 1998. The United States Citadel Star Station was slated to be fully operational by March. Soviet charges that the space station was merely a military launching platform alarmed a number of non-aligned nations. Two weeks before Citadel was due for full operation, the station transmitted a distress signal Immediately after the message was sent, most of the satellites orbiting the planet were swept clean from the sky, leaving the great powers blind. In military panic, each sent their nuclear arsenals skyward. On that day, a company of U.S. Army engineers were in the southwestern deserts, building transportation bridges over dry riverbeds near a newly constructed federal prison for criminals condemned to death. The engineers took over the prison and expelled the inmates into the desolate desert to complete their sentences. The company soon realized that communities beyond the desert's grip had also survived and felt compelled to help these other survivors rebuild and live in peace. Toward this end, the Desert Rangers and the great tradition of the Texas and Arizona Rangers a century before were born. The prison, which came to be known as Ranger Center, cool. grew to be one of the strongest outposts in the wasteland. The Desert Ranger badge of authority, the Ranger Star, is one you wear. New orders await, and with them, your adventure in the wasteland begins. All right. Hey, we just cleared out the prison in Wasteland too. in the future. What a coincidence. After several Whoa. strategy meetings with the leader of the Desert Rangers, General Sergro, you've been assigned to investigate a series of disturbances in the desert. You've been ordered to search for clues in High Pool, the Agricultural Center, and the Rail Nomads Camp, all of which are located to the west of Ranger Center. Cool. These are all the same areas that we just played in. That's awesome. Hey, look! Angela, Death, and Vargas, and Thrasher, and Hellraiser. Okay. Cool. Ranger Center. These are, this is our party. We have Hellraiser has a crowbar. Angela, Death has a pistol. Thrasher has a knife. Okay, cool. Um, play. 
Uh, does anyone know? Is there only four people in a party? If I hit create, does it remake the party? Because I, I want to play with the with with this party. Totally, totally not snake kill skin. Angela. I can get more later, so I can just hit play and this is fine. You get four of your own characters, the rest are NPCs. Okay, let's just play with these guys. Heck yeah. Thank you for following Fi! Hello, welcome, welcome, welcome. Why this looks like the original but with better graphics, I know. Look how lovely it is. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. Journal. Active. Investigate High Pool. You've been ordered to investigate disturbances at High Pool, a community to the west of the Ranger Center. Go there and find out what's going on and fix it. Fix it, damn it. You've been ordered to investigate the disturbances at Real Nomads, Nomads Camp. You've been ordered to investigate disturbances at the Agricultural Center. Okay. Basically, we just need to investigate everything. Do I? Can I go... Uh, oh shit, wait, did it say? Let's go to High Pool first, which is to the west. Why not? Uh, how do I move? What does this do? View. Um, I don't know. Uh, order? Oh! Select player Angela Death. Oh! Wait. Clickies? What's this? Do you want to execute a battle round? What does this mean? I'm so confused. Radio. Yes? Hellraiser doesn't have quite enough experience to be considered for a promotion. Oh, okay. That's just the same thing. Alright. Uh, arrow keys? Oh, no. Really? Can I please... Okay, good. I can use WASD. Alright. Whoa. Check it out, you guys. It's getting warmer. It's very warm. Does that mean I'm going to die from radiation? Uh, what's that? Hello? You see miles and miles of endless wasteland. You decide to f that further progress would be hazardous to your health. Okay. I I I'll listen to you there, game. Uh, how about we go... Okay. Uh, how about we go north, then? Oh, wait. There's something. What's this? Is this high pool? Oh, this is the egg dinner. Yes. Okay, we'll go here then, because I found it. Out outside the sales booth, a group of ten men with axes, hoes, rakes, and shovels shake their heads with despair. I walked past high pool? What? Alright, whatever. We're going here. <laughs> Hello? Miguel. Oh, look at Angela Death. She looks awesome. Closer now, you can hear the conversation of the men you, sa you saw when you came in. There is a short silence after each man voices his thoughts. They speak of varmints who are impossible to kill. The varmints are stealing their food faster than ever before, and they seem to be massing for a major attack. The simple weapons of the farmers are not enough to stop them. They have no idea what to do. One of them jumps as he notices you, and they all turn to face you. A stocky man they call Miguel approaches. You know this is... Your journal. You wrote this in your journal as paragraph 56. Okay. What do you say? Uh, we're gonna get paid for this? Pay? The farmers look at each other, then dig through their pockets and offer you several bits of colored glass and some shiny pieces of aluminum. Seeing the confused look on your face, Miguel says they will also give you food. Alright, I'll do it. I'll do it. Go kill some varmints. Can I save? F9? <laughs> I don't know how to save. What is e? Okay, that's... This is battle, I guess. Order. Disbands. Radio camp journal. Oh, what was that? You hear a whistling noise overhead. It's getting louder. 
You barely manage to jump aside as a giant rotten tomato explodes into the ground, showering you with juice. It's rabbits, isn't it? It's, it's mutant rabbits. You look up just in time to see a giant rotten tomato coming down on top of you. Now you lie in a pool of tomato juice. I mean, there's worse things, right? There's definitely worse things than that. Okay, they're just throwing tomatoes at us for one damage. Hey! What's this? Is this loot? Who wants to loot? Angela Death. Club. Okay. A pineapple? Heavy wooden door reinforced with seal defies you to open it. Okay. What about this one? Can I attack the door? Uh, assault rifle? Uh, equip? Wait, no, I already have that equipped. Use skill, okay. Uh, pick lock? Which way? Ah! Okay, alright. <gasps> Um, attack. With no one in range, Andal of Death chooses to attack. <laughs> the foot tall black rats race toward you with gleaming eyes and razor sharp teeth. One rat and three rats. Okay? Andal of Death chooses to attack. The rat. 22 inch rat. Hellraiser chooses to attack. Uh, attack. Uh, no one is in within range. Okay. Uh, blade? Thrasher chooses to attack. Uh, uh, blade. Snake Vargas chooses to attack. Same rat. Yes. Okay. So I need to get the they only they have melee. How do I how do I make them like move closer to the rats? Okay, Angela Death Attack. Attack the group of rats. Hellraiser. Use. Oh, use that instead. Thrasher. Use that instead. And Snake Vargas. Attack. That. Yes. Yeah, Angela Death, go! 10 points of damage. Okay. This is pretty gripping. Attack the rats. Attack the rats. Attack the rats. Attack the rats! Go! Guns always go before melee. But if some people are using guns and some people are using melee, is this like... One of those games where if you're using melee, you need to be like in the first slot. Like it's a, it's an order of like where you are on the floor, kind of a thing. What? So what if we all? What if we all switch to melee? Would that? Will that work? That's true. Oh wait, you don't even have melee. Never mind.
Yeah, she doesn't have anything else. But I'm guessing she should be in the back, right? Because she's got a gun. Hellraiser's now using his fists. What happened to the crowbar that he had? Didn't he have a crowbar? I don't know. I wish you could remember anything of use. <laughs> Handguns are out to 28 inches or so, or feet or so. SMGs and carbines are good at 60. Some weapons go 80 to 90. Handguns are garbage. Okay, so I can I just un can I just punch the rats? Can I? How do I like get uh, unequipped? Does that do it? I just, you know, click these again. There we go. Yeah, okay, good. Oh, everyone. Oh, we won. Wait, no, we didn't. What? What? I don't understand. Just, just, just. Everyone just punch, punch the rats. Yes, punch them. There we go. Punch, punch. Yes. Angela Death fails to inflict any damage. You know what? That's fine. Somebody had melee weapons. Somebody did. They had a crowbar and a knife. What happened to those? Did they drop them? Oh, wait. No, they can't scroll. Okay. Yeah, what the flip? battle with rap. It does say page one of two. Oh. Oh, right. Okay. Um, well, I can scroll up and down, kind of, but how do I get to page two? Two? Oh, crap! I just pressed two. Oh. Attack. Just... A little bit of a learning curve here! <laughs> Arrows left and right. No! No. Page up down. No. Nope. Not arrows up and down either. Tab. I tried tab. That didn't do it. Is there? Maybe there's a keybinds thing or something? Probably would be good to know. Oops. I wonder how many HPs rats have. Five points. Yeesh. Ah, Vargas, you look badass. Um, yes. The game manual is probably for available to download. I should probably have it open. Just like the old days when you didn't have a manual figuring out the game. This is why I like to look at the options controls before I jump into the game. Trillion pages manual when you need it. Oh, I can get it. I can get it. Wait, I didn't want her to attack with a clip. <laughs> Game, why would I want to do that? Why? Why would I want to do that? Higher. Oh yes, this is going well. Okay. <laughs> Just a second. Just a second. Uh, uh, um, uh, how do I... G extras. Um, that's not, if there's no, what? There is no, there's no manual? What? Uh-uh. 
check for updates? Uh, okay, maybe there's not a manual. That's well, I mean, I could just look at the manual for the original Wasteland, I guess. It said it's in the game. Yeah, it did say that it's in the game. Uh, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna run away. Just everyone run away. I don't know, go that way. <laughs> okay. Is it part of the journal, maybe? Mm. Parag Whoa. Okay, maybe it's the- No, 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 this is the one where I- On Wisconsin! Nice, okay. <laughs> this page is for me. I don't know what all this is, but this is the- This doesn't look like what I want. Passwords, encounters. Uh, interesting. Agricultural I found a, I found a rat. They, oh, these these characters suck. Oh, but I wanted to play with Angela Death. All right, fine. Maybe we'll just start over. I guess I could still I could still make her. How do I? Where is there even? Is there even a menu or anything like? Ah, F one. Oh, F one. Settings. Sorry. Help. There it is. Oh, okay. F1, of course, yes, you know, the age-old, uh, the age-old menu key of F1, yes. Um, okay. Oh, skills. IQ3. Climb. Okay. I mean, these seem pretty self-explanatory. Perception, concealed items. Uh huh. Uh huh. SMG. Okay, yeah, we're let's 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 uh let's start over. <laughs> oh, there's a quick save. All right. These paragraphs were printed in the old version. Game hadn't enough memory to store all the text. At some point, it would say "check paragraph XX," and you would refer to the printed text. Ah. Cool. All right, new game. Uh, yes, I would like to overrate, overrate my save. Yes, that's fine. The following is an X. Thanks, Tension. Vargas. Thanks. Uh, thank you. In combat, distances may seem After a bit far off. Yes, okay. Right, so let's create... I mean, it's sad, because these are all the characters. But they're probably not going to have that much, like, story. Are they? Are they going to have story? If, I, if you don't play with this group, do you miss out on story? Or are they just, you know, characters and that's it? No, not really. Okay. Good. Alright, let's... Uh, no, I have to delete them? Are you kidding me? Can I just, like... I wish I could just edit them or something. Why? the idea that you play as them in this game and then work with them in Wasteland 2. So they don't, if they don't, I guess it's fine if they don't really have a personality. I, don't, I feel bad deleting them though. Right, it's, it's fine. I wish I could just, you know, put them on the side or something. Death. Bye, Vargas. Rest in pepperonis. Oh goodness. Okay, I want to. First of all, I want to do a melee character. Roll again. So um, I'm just gonna treat this like Dungeons and Dragons for the time being, because that's what I know. Uh, it looks like 16 is like the highest. Nope, there's 17. Okay. Mm 
wallet. Oh, wallet is randomized as well. Okay, 14, 10, 13, seven speed. That's not bad. You wouldn't want to rest the pepperonis. 18 is max, okay. That's quite a bit like Dungeons and Dragons. How well your character thinks and solves problems is an important attribute as it determines which skills and how many of them a character can master. Characters start with skill points. Okay. It, this game, I mean, it seems very similar to the second game, so hopefully I can use my knowledge of that to do this. This character seems like a, you know, okay. I'm going to keep, I'm going to keep rolling. What do we got? Just give me somebody with a ton of strength. <laughs> Hello? Ooh, two seventeens. Agility. Uh, okay. Luck and speed? Could this be... Ooh. Could this be... Wait, agility, no. Okay, wait, what's the difference between agility and dexterity, chat? I can't look it up, because I'm... Wait, can I look it up right now? I don't want to lose my role. I don't want to lose... How deftly you move, high agility enhances your acrobatic ability, like dodging and jumping on tables. Okay. And hand-to-hand -hand combat. Dexterity is the ability to master five movements, like picking locks or aiming weapons. Dexterity is very important in combat and extremely useful in movie arts. Ah, crap. Okay, well... I guess we could make we could make a thiefy person then. I mean, it sucks that there's not that they don't have agility. Or wait, no, we could make a dex. Wait, dex is for picking locks. Agility is for movement. Okay. Dexterity helps with aiming. Okay. Well, would this person be like a good sniper or something then? Know, like really high luck, decent, decent uh, everything, really high dex. So it would be a bad thief because it doesn't have agility though. Or wait, am I am I backwards again? Dex is for weapons. Agility helps with dodging. We need high dex for snipes. Okay. Okay. Let's do. Let's go with this guy. This is a good for non melee by the sounds of things. Okay. Except. Enter name. Uh. <laughs> uh. Hello, grow dog. A bad thief has low dice. Do the mods. Okay. So we can have four people. How many how many moderators are in here right now? No ask people in chat? Like the first time? You don't want to be a character, Yogso? How dare you? people in chat for this because I don't know I'm not gonna play this as long this isn't gonna be it's, it's not like it's gonna be a serious playthrough probably so I mean maybe well I don't know but probably not <laughs> pro dagger oh sorry 
<laughs> yeah, basically dizzy. That's that's exactly what I would do. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um. Maybe I'll just use other characters, like other people that we have, you know, met in our games. Uh, like Brad. Do I hit enter? I really am scared of losing my role. <laughs> okay. Uh, mail. He's, he's from, Brad's from the US, I think, right? Okay. Brad wants, um, rifle. I think. IQ points level. So, should we have Brad do... Wait. Uh... Clip pistol? What the hell does this mean? Climbing? So he's not gonna be good at climbing, right? Because he has no agility. So what about, like, perception? Gomez? Sure, we can do Gomez. <laughs> did this release today? Yes, it did. It just released. Start with pistols no matter what you want to do later. Okay. Why did it say clip pistol instead of pistol? Why, what does that mean? Now the need to change pages becomes important. Oh shit, you're right. How do I change pages? Does it work here? No. Uh, is it like... This is hand to hand, I know. The interrogative skills available to characters. Oh. Okay. Pistol with a clip instead of a revolver? Oh, oh, okay. I see. Sparkles? Sure. didn't want you to think there were revolvers in the game. Okay, gotcha. All right, so can anyone tell me how to get to the next page? <laughs> uh, arrow keys don't work. What about like brackets or something? Um, this, no. Page down, no. I don't, I can't, I don't want to press any buttons, like any number buttons, I mean, because that will just, I tried that, I tried the arrows, I tried brackets, A and D doesn't work, um, there must be some really strange button, no, WASDA doesn't work either, J and L. F1 work in this menu. I'm scared to try it because I don't want to lose my role. <laughs> I and K? No? I and K were up and down. So, but it's not J and L either. Kick the side of the page or the page number? Click? Oh, click it. No, there doesn't really appear to be much clicking happening in this game. No, it's not page up, down. No. I guess I'm gonna hit F1. Uh, I hope it keeps it. Uh, is it in help? No. I wouldn't be surprised if it's not in here at all, actually. Tab? No. 
What the hell else? What could it be? Maybe it's in gameplay? What's this? What's ESDF controls? What does that mean? ESDF. That's just moving Wazda over? Why would I do that? I don't know. That's just like one key over. Is that what it was in the original game or something? Uh. Help. <laughs> game concepts. Commands. No. This is all the. This is the in game commands. Lost my character. Oh wait, no, it's fine. Wait, what? Wait, wait. Now was just working. Oh, did I fix it? I think it was broken. Ah, uh, yeah, I think it was broken because I switched it. I switched it to ESDF and back again, and now now it's working. <laughs> okay. All right. Anyways, so. <laughs> All right. So, uh, one in rifle for now. Let's let's see here. Assault rifle. Um, no, we want rifle. Rifle. Pick lock. Silent move. Combat shooting. Confidence. Demolitions. Alarm disarming. Forgery. Okay. Uh. I'm gonna give him some knife fighting too, why not? Um, he did have some strength. So, we're gonna do rifle. A lot of those skill points. Okay, rifle, one in knife fighting. Uh, maybe I should get one in pistol or something. What is combat shooting? bugs. So maybe? Pick lock, he had great decks. Wasn't that governed by agility? No? It was, it was dex? I thought that was agility. Maybe not. Alright. Uh, no, no dex? Okay, sure. Pick lock. Um... Maybe like alarm disarming. Oh, Zed Buffer, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Urkel Dance. Thanks so much, friend. Agility was melee. Oh, okay. Lox was dex. Super annoyed. Okay, does that also mean that like sleight of hand was dex too then? Maybe I should just do that. Silent move. Confidence. No idea. Dirty gambling? I don't know. Forgery. Malicious well, sleight of hand. Uh, okay, I have three points left. I think I'll maybe I'll just put one in pistol because we start with that. And uh, then maybe how many? How many skills should I have per character? Is it like Wasteland 2 where I should limit myself to just a few? Disarming. Or sleight of hand. 
one of each. Why not? Okay, there's Brad. Whatever. Next. Roll again. Okay, now maybe I can get a melee character. Come on. Come on. Give me the good stuff. 15, 13, 17. Charisma? Really stupid. I don't want to be really stupid. Agility. No. no. Okay, intelligence. Uh, nah. Ooh. Whoa. Okay. Intelligence. This guy's pretty good. Sure. Who's this all around dude? Uh, this could be Gomez. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. All right, so he's very smart. <laughs> he's very smart, right? Let's have him do... Well, he's got to have some confidence. I mean, it's Gomez, so... Uh, some bureaucracy. <laughs> oh, wait, medic? Oh, demolitions is different than disarming bombs? Oh no. Uh, Charisma with a melee fighter, charm them, and then whack them dead. Mud. <laughs> Professional wrestler? Yeah, I, I, I get that. I just, it was combined in Wasteland 2, so. The heck is metallurgy? Why is there so much stuff? All right. So what did I get so far? Two confidence. <laughs> this is so overwhelming. Bomb disarm. Safe crack. Cryptology. Metallurgy. Is this crafting? Is this like is that like weapon upkeep or something? Okay, sure. Uh. I wish I could go back to see my skills again, because I kind of forgot what they were. Let's see. Let's have him be pretty good at brawling. Why not? And, uh... Maybe some... Well, he's gonna have a lot of skills. He's really smart, so maybe he could be... We'll just give him pistols, and, uh... <laughs> Bureaucracy. Sure. That sounds good. Super, he's super confident. I don't have enough of those. Uh, and he's good at gambling. And he's, um, good at something. Forgery! There we go. That's, there's Gomez. All right. Okay, so if I if I was gonna make a medic character, I still okay. I want a, me a medic, and I want somebody who's really good in melee. Can I look at my? Okay. Oh no! Oh no! I, his name is screwed up. <laughs> He's Vargas. There's Brad. That works for Brad, sure. <laughs> Dirt Flakes knives, that's true. We're gonna, well, Rice Lord? Okay. All right. So I want, if I wanna have a smart person, or I mean, sorry, a, a, a medic person, I suppose I just want a lot of speed and speed and intelligence. Yes. Ooh, 18 strength. 
Oh, everything else is so bad, though. I can't do that. No. 16 strength. 5 intelligence. Luck, speed, agility. No, I probably want agility if I'm going to be melee. Oh, wait a sec. 17 strength, 16 agility. Not very much speed. This would be okay, right? For melee? Could I do... Um, <laughs> Go, Mess. Int is the most important stat there is. Uh oh. There are inventory slots instead of weight allowance. Well, I'm just thinking about hitting hard in melee. I'm not thinking about carrying weight. The game is loud? Oh, sorry. You guys could have told me that before. Okay, fine, fine, we'll get higher ints. Wow. <laughs> oh, 13, 15? All right, let's just go with this guy, whatever. Uh, poor dude. So what, we got Rice Lord? Um, thank you, Zed Buffer! Ten character charisma could be Helga. <laughs> Actually, Helga was a, Helga was a, was a, a, a air healer. Right? Bertha. <laughs> what did this character's, what was this character's charisma? Yeah, let's do let's do Helga. We do need a girl. <laughs> we need a woman. Uh, I guess Russian. <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna make this person a medic. Cause whatever, medic. Uh, lots of medic, and maybe some. Uh, is there a confidence stat because because your characters can like abandon you and not do what you say? Uh, let's just have her do like assault rifle, maybe. Sure, why not? Okay, last person. Hard hitting melee. That's what I'm going for. Melee dude or woman, whatever. With all with some intelligence and hopefully agility. Oh come on, game. Ah, uh, uh, yeah. I mean that's basically what I asked for, except it's not that great. She had 16 charisma. Max out gambling. <laughs> well, there was no German option. <laughs> I'm gonna keep going. Who doesn't love rolling? Rolling, rolling, rolling. 13, 13, 14, 10. Ooh, 12, 18 speed. Uh, I mean, speed kind of sucks. Screw it. Who needs to be fast when you have a big weapon? All right. Uh, who's the who's our melee person? Let's just do Rice Lord. <laughs> Screw it. <laughs> Gomez and Rice Lord. Uh. What nationality was the rice lord? I don't even I don't even know. He he can be Mexican as well to match Gomez because they're from the same game. They're buddies, of course, you know. All right, uh, this dude, rice lord, is gonna he's gonna be. I think he'll be like melee and uh, demolition. What about... So there's hand-to-hands, -hand, and then there's brawling. What the heck is the difference? I 
Is pugilism, um, you wear like gloves and, and brawling is just like for, because I thought pugilism was basically hand-to-hand -hand combat, is it not? <laughs> I, maybe I'm wrong about that. Brawling is knives and clubs. Ah, okay, cool, then I want that. Knife. I wanted to have big weapons, though. And I got knives on Brad, so we'll do brawling. Uh, somebody needs perception. Shit. Okay, you can have perception, too. And you can be a little acrobatic. More demolitions, more bomb, bomb disarming. <laughs> I feel like we're really gonna be, whatever. It doesn't matter, we're gonna suck, but who cares? Who cares? Acrobat, yes. Okay, finally. <sighs> Just, Jesus. All right, F1, save the game. <laughs> save, resume. Okay. Knife fighting nine, pugils and fizz, brawling, everything else. Thank you, Alm Fighter. Okay, that's that's good. I picked what I wanted then. Right. Uh where are my peoples at? Oh, there we go. Venom, thank you so much for the bits. Regrets not being able to join this party. Dave from sales regrets not being able to join this party. Poor Dave. Hello, Bjorn. May you post a link. Uh, you'll have to ask a mod to post a link. Or there's like a... Actually, there's a command. Maybe you can do like... I forgot what it is. Because nobody ever asked for it. Is it like allow? Exclamation point allow? Something like that. <laughs> is that... The mountain is too big to go around. Is this high, high pool right here? Yay! Yes, I would like to go to high pool. Permit? Ah. Okay. Hang on. Permit? Ale fiend? Did that work? Or you can just whisper a mod. Yeah, whatever. I don't know if that worked. <laughs> Are we almost out of here yet? Rob the King of Plants, thank you so much for the sparkle bits. Unfortunately, we've just begun. <laughs> we've only just begun. The field, uh, the mountain is too big around. The field near you are watered by a canal that gets its water from the creek. Oh, hey, look, it's the nice citizens of High Pool. Hello, citizens. This is a dorm for teens. Nothing much interest there. Okay. Uh, this is a wall. <laughs> this is a dorm for teen. Why is there so many teenagers in here? Whoa, cool! This entry is cool. A store counter's nearby and the room beyond looks like a gaming hall. Hello, friends! He hello, friends. Okay. <laughs> Let me just... Ah, welcome to the shop. Who wants to enter? Bread. Who wants to buy? I have no idea. I, have... <laughs> I don't know anything. Snake squeezings. Do we need certain things? Uh, Gomez? Uh, wait, I should see what we actually have. Um, items. Okay, all we have is pistol and clips. So... Uh, I want you to have a weapon that is not a pistol, but how much monies do we have? Probably, like, nothing. Fourteen dollars. There are two pages of inventory? Oh, you're right. Um. Daha! Okay. Okay, so knife, hand mirror, match, canteen, rope. This this is Helga apparently. I didn't get to pick my portraits. I feel I feel a bit uh I want to equip that. I want everyone to actually wait. Uh hold on. Order 
Rice Lord, Gomez, Helga, Brad. Okay. Oh, shit. Uh, quick save. One. Rice Lord needs to get a crow. Can I attack with a crowbar? Yes. Okay, good. And Gomez. Gomez is brawling. And gambling. Okay, so he wants to attack also with a crowbar, I guess. <laughs> Yay! And then Helga could attack with a knife. Brad will attack with his pistol, because I think I gave didn't I give him some a little bit of pistol? Yeah. I guess. Okay, there you go. You sniper rifle at some point, Brad. Okay, quick save. Okay, I don't know if we need anything. Rice Lord wants to buy a hand mirror, a jug, a map. Ooh, do we need a map? I don't know. Wait, did you actually have med kits? Jewelry. No. Okay, I don't know why I would want any of that, actually. Helga's nose gets bigger as she ages. It's young Helga. <laughs> Hello! Mr. Jumbo. The door is locked. Okay, out of curiosity. What happens if I do use... Shit, who has lockpicking skill? Was it Brad? Pick lock. <gasps> Hello! Hey, what do you think you're doing to my door? Yells the angry juvies. Nothing? Bedroom smells like a scum pit. Is there no loot? One note is a reminder to put a trapdoor over the cave across the creek. Another is about hydrophobia. Hi. Sorry. Mission updated. Investigate high pool. The no tech... Oh. Oops. The no tech to the wall says cave. Adults, raid outlaws, Jackie, Bobby's dog, fix water purifier. Okay, apparently I accidentally got a quest. I found a list of things that are a problem in high pool. Caves, Jackie, Bobby's dog, and a broken water purifier. You've been ordered to... Okay. Alright, can I still shop here? Are you real mad at me, lady? Okay, I guess it doesn't matter. Let's leave! <laughs> What's this? Welcome to the infirmary, Helga. Would you like an exam? No, I don't need an exam. What's this? Ooh. Old machine parts lie on the floor, surrounded by a scatter of tools. Who wants loot? Rice Lord? Ooh. Yes, I do like to loot. Thank you. How did you know? You're appalled by the lack of dildos so far. Hopefully it's just because it's early game. <laughs> I'm sure it is. Oh, hey. A tearful boy watches you from a nearby bush. Oh my god. <laughs> Why is his belly button moving like that? That's weird. This guy looks like an elf or something. Do you want to talk? Yeah. What do you want to ask him about? Do you need help? The kid fidgets and shrugs. I don't know. What are you doing? Do you have dildos? Oh. Really? I can't type that? Do you have dilds? <laughs> uh. Dildos! He's unfamiliar. Too bad. Uh. <laughs> cave! Oh, uh, cave. The cave is over behind the bushes, but we aren't supposed to go there. Why? I don't know. Alright, thanks. Behind the bushes. Okay. 
Are these bushes? That looks like a tree. Bushes. Ugh. Bushes. Ugh. <laughs> uh, okay. Is there bushes over here? No. There's a path into the... What about dog? Don't kill my dog, Rex. Okay, please. Honest, Rex didn't mean to get sick. I just hit him till he got better. Hid. Okay, where is he hiding? I mean, I don't know. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I don't want to kill your dog, Rex. Anybody have perception? Yes. Oh no! Does the person with perception need to actually go first? Didn't I give Brad perception? Who did I- some- I gave somebody perception. Maybe it was Rice Lord. Yeah, Rice Lord has perception. Oh, I have to use it, I bet, don't I? Uh... Go! Nothing special. Okay. I mean, this looks like it's a path. It's not a bush, though. Is it this? Okay. Here's a bush. There's lots of bushes right here. Okay. Cool. Is it on the other side? I seem to have reached an impasse. <laughs> what if I use perception on the kid? You see nothing special. Hello, Orcalistos. Does anyone know where the what am I what am I missing here about this cave? Is it actually not in this area? The soundtrack is really nice, I agree. <laughs> nope, I'm staying here. Apparently there's tons of stuff here for me to do. Caves, Jackie, Bobby's dog, broken water purifier. I've already been in all these. It's here between the bushes, I think. You're just not seeing it? Right here? It's between two bushes on the west wall. You may need to wait a bit for its spot to discover the cave. Press escape a bunch to pass time. Oh. I see. Okay, so it's here. Escape doesn't do anything. But F1 brings up this menu. Spacebar? Nope. <laughs> uh. See? Oh, for camp. Oh, okay. Camping. Sure, okay. Uh, let's use perception. To the wall. 
And then camp? Do we just not have high enough perception? What's happening? Maybe it's here. I mean, there's sort of bushes right there. Because this looks like a path. It really does. The water is cool, but the rocks are slippery. Oops. Spacebar to use perception? Spacebar doesn't do anything. I don't know if there are hotkeys. Okay, um, oh! Excuse me? Hello? That scared the shit out of me. Do you, can I help you? Jeering from hiding, M mutant kids hold slingshots in their hands. Oh, oh really? Oh yeah, well, uh, ah oh, yeah, well, uh, oh yeah? Brad chooses to attack the other ones. Oh yeah. Brad shot someone and killed them. Good job, Brad. they peel off a final shot, the brat blazes away at Helga and hits her for nine points of damage. Ow. Brad gains eight experience. Um, okay. We got a jug. Two brats appear at ten feet. Attack, 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 attack. <laughs> Brad is killing everyone. Rice Lord killed someone. Okay. <laughs> All right. Are we just are we just murdering Chubby Kid? <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> this is hilarious because we're in High Pool right now, which is the same. Uh, how about we just, uh, how about we just, you know, <laughs> hire you. Can we hire you? <laughs> hmm. Evade. Evade. Everyone just evade? Yes. <laughs> Why? Why do these people jump scare me? Chubby kid. Hi. Uh. Mutants. Dog. Where is dog? Cave. Bobby. Um. Water? Pure. Purifier. Kids. Okay, you're useless! Jackie. Oh, yeah. Jackie. I told Jackie to keep clear of the cave. Great. Bushes? The cave is between the pool and the west cliff wall. Kind of between those two trees. Oh, is that what I needed to ask? Oh, what? Why are you? I... Oh, now I can use perception. Oh, okay. I see. Never mind. Um, do I have to use it here? Oh, I have to go over a square first. Okay. 
All right. You find a deep hole in the dark cave. A short strand of frayed rope about three inches long dangles from a tree limb. Okay. Go. Go in cave. Climb? Do I have to use the climb skill? I don't have the climb skill. Oh no! Are we just boned? Are we just totally boned? Use your agility to go to the... Uh, oh, we need a rope, of course. Yes, of course. Okay. Uh, Rice Lord, use rope. The rope is tied to a tree. Want to slide down into the cave? Yes. Okay. Even here, the cave is very dark. The floor is rocky. It looks beautiful, though. Okay, thank you, chat. <laughs> I'm absolutely allowing backseating, in case you guys didn't know that. Helga has climb? Oh, no, I don't think so. <laughs> That's true, we don't have a good history with rope. I see a doggo! The cave walls are damp. Is that the dog that I'm not supposed to kill? Uh, rocks and boulders make it difficult to pass. Okay, cool. Can I perceptivize that area? Ugh. Nope. Okay. Um, use demolitions. Blow it up. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, Rice Lord, you blew yourself up. Uh, use. Eh. I don't know. You can use rocks to train climbing. Okay, you will get hurt though. Does anyone have climbing? Use medic skill? Oh, yeah, use medic skill on yourself. You can't heal yourself. What do you mean I can't heal myself? Use your agility to go that way. Um, Helga takes five points of damage. If you keep running at the thing you can climb, your skill will eventually rise. Really? Okay. So we just sit here and grind climbing skill? <laughs> Is this working for everyone? Or... Really? Medic skills only used to recover unconscious and worse states. If you want con points back, you have to either pass time slowly or pay a doctor. Oh, okay. Um, is this really what I'm supposed to be doing right now? <laughs> you might have to possess the skill first, though. It's been a while. <laughs> oh, God. Oh dear. Okay. I bet you do. I'd be willing to bet that you do. Well, how about we use... Can we just punch? Can we just, like, attack the rocks? Ugh. <laughs> Rice Lord gets hit. Okay. Let's just camp. Let's sleep in the cave. Mm, that was fun. Radio, yes. Um, view. Don't remember if skills popping out of nowhere. This is why Vargas was doing the thing at his desk. <laughs> I haven't killed enough children to level up. <laughs> okay, do I, am I not able to do this, chat? Can I just not? Should I just leave? I want to 
want to execute a battle round. Attack! <laughs> Actually, no. I don't know. I don't know what I want to do. Do I need to find a library? I don't know. <laughs> I guess we'll just leave. Hi. How do I... Can I inspect, like, a person? Somehow? You see nothing special. Go look for a hole in the floor in the main building. Okay. Thank you. I found a hole in the floor in the main building. Perception. There is nothing special. Maybe I have to ask about it first. How do I, uh... Um... At least this will confuse future geologists as to why the cave has a small outline as a person on its wall. <laughs> okay, let's use, uh... Skill... No. Um... Brad? Uh, different building? Really? Oh. Well, that's definitely a hole. This building? That's the hospital. No, this is the workshop. That's definitely the main building, right? Yeah, there's, a, there's no other buildings. The workshop? Okay. Maybe that's... Is this the water purifier right here? A pump? Okay. You see nothing special. Um. <laughs> Fix pump. Hi, Tom. Tom, have you ever played this? You're like the master of really old, annoying games. <laughs> oh, look, it's Tom. You'll need to buy a replacement. Okay, so I'm missing an item. Does this guy sell it? Because that would just be silly. No? Sledgehammer. Book, canteen, crowbar, gas mask. Match. No, he doesn't have it. So we need to go somewhere else? <laughs> Not yet. Is it annoying? Well, it's just, it's not annoying. Well, I don't know. It's just hard. It's not annoying. I didn't mean, I didn't mean that in a negative way. I just meant it like, you know, n like not obvious kind of old game sort of stuff. As I recall to fix the pump, you need an engine from the, okay. All right. Uh, thank you. So maybe I should not have gone here first. Does anyone know? If I have any way to get in the cave to get at the dog, or should I just... By the way, did did I use my rope? Should I buy a new rope now? Oh shit, yeah, now, now Reisler doesn't have his rope anymore. The dog is trouble. Okay, gotcha, all right, cool. Uh, let's just leave then. All right, bye, I think. Unless there's something else I can do. Jackie. Oh, that's the caves. Okay, this is all in the caves. <sighs> Alright, let's go to the nomad camp. <laughs> Everyone go give uh, go give Tom a, a follow on his channel. He plays lots of other games like this, so you know. If you like this, then I'm sure you will like all the games that, that he plays. He is probably way better than them, 
at them than I am, for sure. Yes, I would like to enter a new location. Okay. Uh, Rail Nomads Camp. Well, it's probably north. I could go back to the Ag Center. Yeah, you know what? Let's go. Let's go here again. Let's go here and see if we can do any better fighting the stupid rats and stuff. Since now I actually have, like, I kind of know how to do the combat a little bit. Hello! Alright, I already read that last time. Offer to help? Miguelis, please, the other farmers smile and thank you. They lead you to the vegetable field. In the shadow of an enormous satellite tracking dish uh. stands the old man. Over a hundred years old, he is still vigorous and bright of eye although he rambles incoherently at times. The farmers remove their hats as they approach and wait for him to speak. Frowning, deep in thought, he stares at what appear to be the remains of a 15-foot-tall carrot. carrot. He holds a long shaft of broken metal in one hand and mumbles something about wascally wabbits that he had to beat to <laughs> his best rank. Miguel uh -huh. explains that you've come to help. The old man studies your weapons and tells you that he doesn't think your pea shooters will do any good against the armored varmints, but that you're welcome to try. If you succeed, he wants you to come back and see him. There's something he'd like to show you. Free to roam the veggie field, you head towards the carrot patch. From a distance, you hear the old man warn you, watch out for Harry, the bunny master. Bunny master, oh, we get a free, we basically get to go in here for free, okay. Last time I walked in myself. All right, cool, uh, the bunny master, eh? Hmm, all right. Hmm, the wascally wabbits. What's this? Wall of steel with faint outline on the door in the center. A crudely written sign reads root cellar. Am I not allowed? Is that where we came from? Okay. Let's go get those wascally wabbits. Ooh, loot. Uh, use... Brad, skill, pick lock. Rice Lord. Ooh, a crowbar and some fruits. Yum, 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 yum. Ah, hello. I see a lizard. Giant tomatoes. Hopefully not the killer variety. Desert lizards appear at 28 feet. Ooh. No one is within range. Run. Which direction should you run? That way. Use these options. Counter begins. Giant tomatoes. Hopefully not of the killer variety. Uh, let's run everyone. Yes. Okay, I'm getting closer. Um, one more. Okay, is, are people getting hit? I'm not sure. All right, now we can attack, 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 attack. Yes. Brad hits for one. Lizard pounces on Gomez. Gomez misses. Gomez brutalizes the lizard for four. Helga misses. Rice Lords hammers the desert lizard for six points of damage. Attack! Go! Rice Lord, Rice Lord's kicking ass. Look at this. Where are the wabbits? I don't know where the wabbits are. Ooh, Rice Lord. Okay, why do things have so much life? It's just a lizard. Yes, Gomez brutalizes it. One of, he killed him. Okay, good. They're they're dying. We're getting them. Go, Brad. Helga is having some problems. Um. Ooh. Wait, Helga didn't get any experience. Does she have to actually kill something herself to get experience? That's a little lame. Oh! Oh, you see a large man. Harry. 
bunny. Here's that one feet. A large farmer's walking around among the green leaves of this carrot patch. Sensing your approach, he stops moving and watches you with ominous eyes. Filled with hatred for you and your kind, this is Harry, the bunny master. <laughs> you only get combat XP for a killing blow. Really? Oh my goodness. Okay. Ah, hello, Harry. That's a nice axe you've got there. I, I suppose that we'll just attack you. Because why not? Brad's weapon jammed. Of course it did. Of course it did. Uh-huh. Okay. Yep. Harry pounces on Rysler for 19 points of damage! Ooh, we're gonna die. We're, we're gonna die. Brad, unjam your stupid weapon. Okay, uh, well, Ray Sword's still alive. So let's keep going. Bunnies are ravaging Rice Lord. <laughs> Weapon gems mean you lose the ammo. Oh, great. All right. Well, I mean, he's still alive, so let's just keep attacking. Brad attacks Harry and kills him. The bunny bowls into Gomez. Oh, we got him, you guys. We won? Whoa! We got some cash. The old man is pleased to see that you have killed Harry. His destruction will demoralize the remaining varmints. A holiday will be declared in your honor. Farmers cheer nearby. Murdering the cute little animals has rescued you their major food supply. Aw, Garsh. Hooray for us. Hooray for us, I guess. Okay, now we're almost dead, though, which is bad. Um, hey, there's some more loot over here. Use your peak lock. Club. Ooh, is that better? Ooh, um, items. How do I tell? How do I know if a club is better than a correct crowbar? Oh, do I need to look at the manual to figure that out? Probably. I probably do. Okay. Um, injuries and death. Disbanding one character and sending him off across the desert to find a doctor will not freeze time for a seriously wounded character. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um, items. Overview. Weapons list. Hey, there's laws. Yay! Short range weapon? Grenades? Uzis? Medium range? No. May missile weapons? And so Wabbit Whacking Day was celebrated henceforth. <laughs> uh, why? What am I? I can't see the melee weapon list. Am I blind? Long range weapons? Assault rifles? Oh, wait. Short range weapons, maybe. No? Uh... Each character can carry 30 items. If you drop it, it will vanish into the depths of wasteland, never to be seen again. <laughs> okay. 
All right, cool. Maybe all melee weapons are the same. Maybe they are. That's weird. What's the point then? Well, just use it, because why not? All right. Okay. My sharp senses detect the movement of a large white object moving among the thick stalks of wheat. Oh, sorry, I just ran my face into my microphone. A deranged farmer at 30 feet. Oh no. Benny Stringbean, thank you so much for the bits. Bunny Master Hype. Who's this deranged farmer guy? Rice Lord chooses. He's got a gun. Does he actually have a gun? Um, run single that way. Run single that way. Run single that way. Attack. Yes. Ah, oh, damn. Okay. Run that way. Do you want to execute a battle round? Yes. Run single player that way. Run that way. Run that way. Yes. Okay. Yes. Brad, attack. Rice Lord. Attack. 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 Yes. All right. Oh, we got him. Brad's stealing all the experience. <laughs> oh, an op a possum that looks just like a rat. What did I do? Go back. Go back. Go back. Okay, Brad chooses to attack the possums. Everyone else shall attack. No one is within range. Okay. Yes. Uh, Brad chooses to attack. Rice Lord runs. Party that way. Yes. Okay. Where are they even? Oh, they're that way. Oh, crap, I was going the wrong way. Attack. All right. Attack, 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 attack. Yes. According to the wiki, first deal, fist deal 1d6 damage, club steel knives, Clubs and knives deal 3d6. Crowbar isn't listed. Okay. Interesting. Thank you, Yogso. Some more loot over there. Ah! Two, ra two more rats! Man, I don't know if Rice Lord's gonna make it here. Eh, he'll be fine. Get him! Yeah, go Rice Lord. Uh oh. <laughs> Shit. Uh... Oh wait, he's back up! Yay, Rice Lord got some experience. Good job, Rice Lord. Okay, he's back up. He was unconscious for a second, but he's fine. He's fine. Scratch the door, but it still defies you. You know what, door? You wanna go? You wanna go, door? Ugh. Oh, yeah, I showed you what's up, door. More fruits. Yum, yum, yum. I love, I love fruits. I wonder what kind of fruits. Why, are, why is every door locked? Okay, I think we should camp. <laughs> Since we're pretty dead fruits are money okay hello 
Uh, Rice Lord would like to sell you some some. Can I sell like this all this shit? Can I just sell everything, including the jewelry and the clay pots? Is this all junk? Okay, thank you. Oh my God, we're so rich. We are so rich. What do you have? <laughs> what do you know? He has the stuff I sold him. Okay. Uh, I guess we did this. We showed these. We sh you know, the egg center. We saved everyone. Rangers to the rescue. I didn't enter the old man's root cellar. Ah, oh, crap. No. Okay, you're right. Can I do that? How do I do that? Uh... Zoom, zoom, zoom. Let's see, it was like over here somewhere. Oh! Ah! Ooh, boy! Hello there! Armored, long-eared, pink and white lumps of fur are hopping around here while pink eyes pops up in front of you. Three bunnies. Wascally wabbits. Oh, crap. And lizards. Oh, this is maybe kind of dangerous. Um, maybe we should, like... Maybe we should attack them all. <laughs> I guess we'll kill the bunnies first? I don't know. Yeah, we'll be fine. We rested for like two hours. <laughs> ah. Yeah, get him, Brad. Brad should not be in the front. Oh God, it's fine. You know what, it's fine. Um, Brad, could you, like, could you evade? And then Helga, could you use a skill on Ice Lord? And then you attack the bunnies. Okay. This is, this is, <laughs> this is, this is not going very well. Attack bunnies, attack bunnies, attack bunnies, yes. Yes, uh, the possum also looks suspiciously like a rat. Not sure. It's fine, though. It's fine. The desert? Oh. Oh, boy. Alright, everyone just attack. That was pretty good. Helga still didn't get any experience. Man. Oh. Uh. Helga? <laughs> could you please, could you please resuscitate Brad? Brad's improving. Cool. All right, let's camp. Uh-oh. Oh boy. Oh boy. It's a little it's getting a little dire around here. Melee weapon summary. Fists are 1d6. Almost everything else is 3d6. Two exceptions. Chainsaw. Uh, wow, okay. We need to we need to get somebody a chainsaw. Heck yeah! Okay. Everyone is fine. Rice Lord is improving. Can <laughs> we? Hi! All right. Maybe we should not go into this guy's uh, cellar right now. Oh, come on! <laughs> God damn it. Kill the possums. Kill them all. Did you finish Wasteland 2? Wasn't able to beat the second half. I just got to the second half. Um, are you talking about California? Like when it starts to get really hard? We just got there, and it, it is uh, quite the difficulty spike. Yes. But I'm still working on it. I'm still working on it. I, I do plan to beat it. I will try my very best. Uh, uh, this 
is a nice... Whoa! There's a nice root cellar. The rotting door rests on broken hinges. This room would have been an, an electronics hack's dream a hundred years ago, but all the equipment now seems gone beyond repair. Unidentifiable machine parts. An instrument console with broken gauges covered by a fine layer of dust. What? What have I done? <laughs> okay. Uh, tables full of old junked radio equipment. Uh -huh. Okay. Hello? Why is there blood? The wall seems to be plaster. It looks like there's blood there. Oh, wait, not you. Um, sleight of hand. Okay. Rice Lord. Use perception. Okay. This area is obviously a storage room with many old wooden crates and empty boxes. Nothing is in this box. Am I about to get blown up? Oh. No, damn it. No, damn it! Heck yeah! Okay. Rice Lord. Nice! Plastic explosives. I forgot who is the explosives person, but I definitely did give explosives to someone. Sweet! What about this hole in the ground right here? Is that anything? No, okay. Blue type! I am checking every space. I think I got them all. Okay, uh, we need to switch the order around. Rice Lord, Gomez, Helga, Brad. And then... Uh, who had... Was it Rice Lord? No! Rice Lord that had? Yeah, so Rice Lord is the bomb guy. So, Brad. Uh, you give this to Rice Lord. Okay. Uh, wait, are these just the same guns I already have? Really? <laughs> really? Yeah, it is. Poopy! That's... Ugh. Don't, doesn't everyone already have those? A single NPC token on the map can have up to three enemy groups on it, and each group in the token can have one or more enemies on it. Holy crap. Alright. Uh, maybe I could try perceptioning, like, in here. I, there was a noise that happened. Yeah, like when I go there, there's a noise that happens. It doesn't seem to. It must just be a scripted thing, I guess. Okay. Never mind. What if we camp in here? God, that's so slow. One HP per rest? Holy crap. <laughs> Ooh. All right. Uh, do you want to see my root cellar? No, old man. I already took everything is in that's in your root cellar. Your fourth guy has a pistol with no ammo in it. Oh, he does? Brad? Oh. Uh, Ah! Oh, yeah, you can see. I didn't even notice. Okay, yeah, thank you. Alright, cool. So, uh... I guess we're done here then, right? Boom! Doesn't seem to work.
sell. You're we temporarily out of stock. What? You have money, don't you? Jeez. Hold C to camp a lot. Oh, thank you. Okay, yeah, I should have done that. Let's do that before we leave. Oh, that's better. Well, actually, not really. It still only does a couple. Hello, Silverleaf. I hope that passing a bunch of time is fine. All right. There we go. That's good enough. There are no time sensitive events. Fabulous. Okay. So, there's a railroad thing. Is that the real nomads camp? A mine shaft. Ooh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh goodness. Jelly Canuck, thank you so much for the Gifted subs. Thank you so much, friend. How are you? T. Catherine, Siri, Pedrusdal, Fracture, and Edat. Welcome to the Cheesy Horde, everybody. Or welcome back if you're already, you know, a member. Thank you so much, Jelly Canuck. How's it going? I believe that definitely constitutes the Cheese Chronomicon edition. Do you, do you have to fill up your canteens, like in Wasteland 2? Or do you just have to have them and then you're good? Alright. There you go. Thank you so much, Jelly! Back to lurking. Okay, thanks so much, friend. Appreciate it. Thank you for spreading the cheese. Canteens are magic? Oh, that's good. At least we have that going for us. Fill them with cherry slushy. Mm. The old shack is made of a weather-beaten abode. Uh, ado oh, adobe, sorry. A door of rotting, wait. A door of rotting wood and rusting iron. Of course it's locked. Just attack it. If it's rusting, fine. Ugh. Dirt floor is covered with dry desert weeds. It looks like someone or something has been sleeping here. <gasps> oh no, three scavs. How you doing? Kill the scum, yell the desert scavs. Scavengers? Rice Lord. Attack. Attack, attack, attack. Woo! Yeah. Helga brutalizes but fails to inflict any damage. Oh no, Helga, why? Maybe I should get, give Helga a gun. She's not doing any damage. That's why she can't, uh... That's why she can't get any experience. <laughs> so let's just do that. Alright. Oh, wait. She has a different kind of pistol. Oh. Yeah, there you go. Canteens, a shovel, and a pickaxe. Well, I guess we didn't have a pickaxe, so that's some, something. Whoa, hello there, glow viper. This glow viper looks suspiciously like a lizard. <laughs> oh my god. Um. Well, good job, Gomez, I guess. Uh, okay. Brad, I need you to wake up. Uh oh, God, we're so boned, aren't we? Can we not wake up? Oh, uh oh. <laughs> yeah. 
Young Helga, her nose hasn't gotten big yet. Yes, I wasn't able to pick the portraits, unfortunately. How is this game? Well, I, I think it's good, but I, uh, I'm not exactly sure, you know? I mean, it's, uh, I, I need a little bit more time before I give my opinion. It seems like a really good RPG. I just, oh, oh God, um, Helga, why Helga? Oh God, we're gonna die. We're all gonna die. It's, there's a bit of a learning curve because it's, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's very old, so. This is not good. This is very bad. This is, this is bad. Oh, this is real bad. Rice Lord, you're, you're, you're amazing. Maybe we should radio in. <laughs> Rice Lord has achieved the rank of Private First Class Rice Lord. Private first class rice lord. You get two adventure points to distribute among your stats. Okay, cool. I'm gonna take uh, uh, Max Khan. I'm gonna take some more strength, you know? All right, so how do I save my friends? Serious, yeah, so uh, Brad is in critical condition and Helga is in serious condition. Do I need to leave? And then... Because if I rest again, I'm just gonna get attacked. I don't know, I guess I'll keep trying. Naked mole rats. Hey, those are familiar. All right, go Rice Lord. Oh. Wait, Rice Lord went unconscious, but somehow he won? <laughs> Let's try rest. Oh, no! Wait, I'm gonna try. They will get worse. Okay. What the frick is that? Oh! This, this is it, Rice Lord. This is where you bite the dust. Wait, Brad is no. Okay. Okay, yeah, they're just they're just killing me over and over again now. No, I just want to We're going to reload. <laughs> Did I do a big save last? Oh yeah, it must have been a big save. Okay, load. Uh, that one? Ah. Well, let's rest some more. There we go. Okay, uh, can we go back? What's this? Nothing? It's very hot. Okay, don't go that way. It's bad news bears. I'm gonna go back in here. Cause I, cause I can. And I'm a, I'm a dangerous, dangerous kind of, kind of dude. Or three dudes and one not dude. You know how it is. I'm gonna go this way first. Naked mole rats. Oh yeah, bring it on. Bring it on, mole rats. Uh, oh, run. Party. Where are they? That way! Yeah, there they are. Yeah, I see him. I see him. I see him hiding there. Go! Alright, I need to give Helga a knife. Alright. Helga! I mean, not a knife. I need this. There you go. There's a dead person there. Whoa! The mountain is made of sandstone, but still very strong. Oh, that's, that's cool game. Uh-oh. Blind mind crawler. You know what? That's fine. Uh, that's that's fine. Uh, Gomez and Rice Lord should be right at home, right? Getting my ass kicked. Yes, I am. Yes. <laughs> it is 
the naked mole rats. Uh, Rice Lord needs to run. I think it's that thing. Oh, wait, what is it? This? I don't know. Gomez needs to run that way. Helga needs to attack, attack, yes. You know what? Let's just all run. There's a lizard there. I don't know if it's that or that. Let's just go this way. Whatever. Attack. Attack, attack. No one is within range. Run. Run. Yes. Are we not in combat with the thing I think we're in combat with? It's really hard to tell. <laughs> Oops. Okay, we're, we're like right next to something. Do you want to execute a bat? Oh, wait, was I attacking the wrong thing? I don't even know. It's a, it's a lizard game, it's a lizard. It's not a mind crawler. Wild girl. Okay. A half eaten remains of what might've been human. Kira is scattered around. Who is it? Oh, is it? I like, I like gear. Canteen. That's it. That's it, huh? Okay. Great. Um, order. Rice Lord. Mez. Helga. Great. You're not sure, but they might have made the game worse by remastering it. Really. Why is that? The rocks look strange. Oh, these rocks. Oh, wait, yeah, could I, like, use my pickaxe on them? Can we get one of those? Uh, club? Somebody got one. Or was I, oh, wait, maybe not. Uh, maybe I, I didn't loot it yet? Wait. Does someone else have it? I thought I picked it up, but maybe I didn't yet. All right. <sighs> Metallurgy, okay, yeah, no, nobody has that, I don't think. I can't use it unless I have it, can I? No, okay. Is that a creature? I'm just gonna go over here with this guy. Uh -huh. Woo! DND! 45 flips. That goes to Helga. Oh, wait, no, he's got one of those too. Well, let's just. Alright. Yeah, I did loot the shack first. I thought I would go this way because, you know. Ah! Fine, I guess we'll go over there. Yeah. Alright, everyone attack. Oh my god, that's a lot of lizards. One group, that's not bad. Okay. Um well uh <laughs> run. Run. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh 
boy. Uh, wake up, friends. Oh, Helga's awake. No, she's not. Damn it, that's her ammo. <laughs> I keep thinking this is their health. Oh, wait, now she is. All right, cool. We're fine. Your footsteps echo strangely through the vaulted darkness of this mine. Wake up, buddy. An axe. That's cool. That's cool, Rice Lord. You should use that instead. That's pretty cool. Uh, <laughs> I think. Let's give the let's give the club to Gomez. Here we go. Upgrades. Oh my god. Ah! Tunnel lizards. Um Okay, you just evade, evade, attack, attack. Yes. Come on, guys! Did he come closer? Wait. Okay, no, he didn't. Um, evade, evade, attack. Reload your weapon. Oh, no! <laughs> Brad, why you miss? They're not gonna come to us, are they? Okay then. Now are we close enough? Okay. Uh oh. This is not good. Attack. Use skill medic on Gomez. <laughs> this is futile at this point. Okay. Okay. Uh, where did I save last? Music reminds you of Deus Ex Human Revolution. Yeah, you're right, actually. It does. Okay, uh, well, how about this way? This way looks nice. There's a skeleton. Oh! Uh. Okay. Evade, evade. Attack, attack. Am I not close enough to fire my pistol? Maybe we should all run at least one. Two. Okay. Attack. Evade. Evade. Attack. Attack. There we go. Okay, now we can hit at least. <laughs> Helga attacks the rubble fanger. Brad attacks the rubble fanger. Yay, we did it! Is that something? No. Oh! Okay, there's that horrible monster thing. I don't know what that is. I don't like it. I don't like whatever it is. I'm not a huge fan of that thing. Knives? Yeah, whatever. Five drools. Yeah, that. Are they gonna come at us? Reload your weapon. Okay. Oh yeah, one point of damage. Oh, 
don't think uh, this is working. <sighs> you know what? Let's just charge in. What could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? It's fine. Right? Yeah! Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like we need some armor penetration. <laughs> You know what I'm saying, guys? Oh boy. No way we won? No way! How did we manage that? Ooh, cash. What a bunch of crap loot, though. Uh-oh, eight little people? What? Little pe- what? Um, okay. Uh, sure, I guess. <laughs> I guess we're gonna have to leave. Oh! Leave me alone! What is it? Do? Okay, it's fine. It's just. Let's just leave. <laughs> Clearly this is way too difficult for me. Let's just leave. Uh, can I even leave? That's a good question. Ah! Uh-oh. That's not happening. All right, maybe, uh... Maybe, uh, you know, we'll get, we'll do something else. Should we do something else? Yeah, let's do something. Like, let's do something else. Maybe we should not go there. All right, cool. Um, so, real nomad camp? What's this? The Guardian Citadel. Okay. dangerous. Um, are you gonna shoot me? Carved into the side of the mountain, you see a huge black structure. You recognize it as the Guardian Citadel. You know the Guardians will be strange collectors of old items and xenophobic ghouls who would not hesitate to kill strangers without ever seeing the whites of their eyes. You've learned that the flags are in place to mark the closest an outsider may approach the walls before being attacked. You note this in your journal. A defender on the wall yells, leave wasteland scum, you are not old enough to die here. Ah. That's nice. I'll just go this way then, shall I? Cool. Okay. Cool. Oh, this looks like real road people. Desert nomads. You've come upon All right, the cool. Rail there we go. Camp. Ornery looking That's what I want. Cattle wander among dusty tents from which sullen faces peer. In the background, a ramshackle collection of railroad cars patched with wood, hide, and an odd piece of corrugated aluminum sits on a rail siding. Two of the cars, the locomotive at the front and the caboose at the rear, appear to be in better condition than the others. As you approach, a strained silence falls over the camp and you grow uncomfortable under the collective gaze of the assembled nomads. Finally, one of the nomads steps forward. Welcome, Rangers. I am the brakeman of this train. I'd be honored if you would visit me in the caboose before leaving our camp. In the meantime, please accept our hospitality. The brakeman turns and strides back into the camp. Okay. Thanks. Thanks for your hospitality. The guard stops you at the entrance to the tents and requests that you state your business. Help. What? Um. Pump? Shop? Okay. I don't know. Hello. 
Ooh. As you pass the open doorway of this car, you're almost overcome <laughs> the by the strong spike. odor of fermented cactus fruit. As your eyes become accustomed to the darkness of the car, you can make out a straw-colored floor littered with numerous bottles of Dr. B. Bilios Balfour's snake squeezes. At the back of the car lolls a rotund bearded figure rocking back and forth as if the mere act of sitting offered a difficult feat of balance. Finally, seeming to take notice of you, the shadowy figure issues an invitation. Welcome to my humble abode, gentlefolk. Step on in. Thank you. Enter and be enlightened and amazed by the wisdom of the hobo. Hick, snort. The hobo beams at you blearingly. Good people, I would like nothing better than to speak to you of things spiritual. But alas, I seem to have run short on the ambrosia which inspires my visions. The, to demonstrate, the hobo appends an empty bottle of snake squeezes. I believe I have some of that. I don't remember. I don't know. Can I... Did I pick up some of that or not? Maybe I didn't. Maybe that was in one of the lives that didn't actually happen. Um, the hobo looks at you expectantly. I don't know if I did. Nope. Okay. Bye. You can have one of my crowbars, and you can have this hand mirror and this jug. Uh, you can have none of that. You can have. Okay, I mean, why do I have a hand mirror? That guy doesn't. He doesn't want to. Doesn't want to buy much. All right. Oh wait. Yeah, he didn't have any snake squeezes. Okay. Well. Hello. Dire coyote? What are you, what? Oh! Where are they? So many of them. Holy butts. Yeah, she hit like a rat for one damage or something. Uh, I do, I, if I remember correctly. <laughs> uh huh. That didn't help, Brad. Uh oh. Okay, there you go. Come on, Brad, wake up. We got wake to do here. Golden Spike. He doesn't know anything about it. What about this guy? Um, business rangers. Um, job. Why isn't Brad waking up? Nuke pooches! Great. So this isn't even like a safe camp at all. <laughs> it's just... Who said it was 
is safe. I don't know, it's a camp. Why do they have angry coyotes running around everywhere? Ah! What? Oh, okay. Uh... All right, I guess there's raiders here too. Okie dokie. Hello, cows. Ah! No. Alright, um. Well, okay, so I can come back and give that guy snake squeezins. That's what I learned. I'm on the wrong side of the tracks. Oh, I see. Okay. Well, uh, it's getting warmer. Okay. Ooh, wow. Oh, boy. That's, that's very dangerous over there. So how do I get, somebody said I need a pump from these guys. What am I asking this guy about? Disturbances? Is that what I type? Dis... Disturbances? Uh... Wes... Help... Offer help? Our shop was selling an engine? Was that what we need? Maybe. Five hundred? Can I sell? I thought I, I thought people had fruit. Did Brad have fruit? Maybe he just doesn't want to buy fruit. I did have some. Didn't I get some extra weapons? He doesn't want to buy that either. You can pull your money together. Well, I think Rice Lord has all of the money. Basically. Yeah. So, uh. Work. Tent. Leader. Come on, kill him. Gomez can't inflict any damage. Oops. Dang it. Interesting. Did I did I not Okay, we don't have an axe in this reality, so Never mind. Just attack everything. This guy has a lot of armor or what? Rice sword gains 480 experience. I should just made everyone melee masters. That's what I should have done. Uh, okay, so... Investigate? 
community. Uh, uh, caterpillar? Why would I type caterpillar? What does that mean? Axe is the same as any other melee weapon. Yeah. Was Gomez always not doing damage? I... What am I missing with the quest? Investigate high pool. No, investigate real nomads. Dis investigate disturbances at the real no... Do I... I mean, there's plenty of disturbances here. I can't talk to that guy. I need. Do I need. Do I need to have snake squeezings to do this? Is that what it is? Snake squeezings. Drugs. Go to the caboose. Oh! Oh, there's a dude right here. The brakeman meets you at the door of the caboose. He thanks you for heeding the investigation, and he has something for you to deliver. Okay, I didn't even the see Brakeman that guy. You, okay. Take this visa card and give it to Head Crusher and Quartz. Head Crusher? As the brakeman passes <laughs> you the card, okay. the sunlight catches the dove hologram and glints brightly. That's you the slide visa it into card. your breast pocket as he turns and leaves without another word. Who wants the loot? Rice Lord. Okay, cool. Let's go shopping! Now we have a credit card! Okay, yeah, I did not see that guy at all, so... Great. Uh, save. How I get it myself. Oh, that's how I get the password? With a credit card? Well, we have to leave, right? To deliver it somewhere? Head Crusher, who is in the town of Quartz. Do we know where the town of Quartz is? There's an animal. Go to the overland map. Okay. Uh, where's that? <laughs> It's very warm. Wasteland warriors. Hmm. Helga oh. Oh. brutally pummels the wasteland warrior but fails to do any damage. Okay, attack, attack. Weapon, switch to that, please. And you attack. Yes. <laughs> Rice Lord! Do you need to level up again, Rice Lord? Yes, you do! Okie dokie then! Uh, well, how about more speed? Why not? What could, uh, what could possibly go wrong? Or it should be along the river, okay? So there was the river was like over here. Oh shit! Oh my god, Brad! Brad! 
Don't drown, Brad. I didn't expect it to let me go into the water. Hello, city. Oh, okay, I found him. Oh. Brad almost died. Hello, Scots. Ah! I walked into a cactus. The spines poke you and hurt a lot. Oh, all right. <laughs> okay. Yes. I'm not ready. Ozoner. The card players stop their game and grab their guns. One carries a rifle. Why? What did I do to you guys? Ozoner. Man, I sure wish Brad had his HP. Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> this oh <laughs> okay uh, well we're not dead yet Helga has one life <laughs> can't oh I can leave <laughs> she did damage um I actually think I'm gonna reload instead where did I save? Ah, good. Now I can not go into the water. You know what I should do? I should just go here and rest again. <laughs> go in the front door next time. Oh, is that why they attacked me? Because I went in the back door? What the flip? Thank you. Wish the remaster focused on intuitive controls instead of animations. Yeah, I was hoping that it would be like that too. Like, uh, like a, you know, a little bit more of a modern experience. I mean, this is okay. Like, the movement out here is fine. I don't know what the original game is like, but, um... I kind of was hoping it would be a little bit changed. The manhole leads northeast. Uh, okay. Hello, everyone. An abandoned shack. Ooh. Need supplies. Get out. Help. The walls are breaking apart. Okay. The door opens. Watch it. You almost stepped on that snake. Good thing it was leaving the room. What snake? Okay. I'm not sure, I guess. Okay. Anyone need to use the bathroom? Okay. This looks like a nice place for loot. Okay. Dead guy. A little bit smoky in here. Okay. Whoa! Good job, I stepped and killed the scorpion. Be careful, there might be more. Okay. Hello, war ride. Um, it's, yeah, I mean, it's good. Yeah, definitely. It's that, it takes a lot of learning. If you're not familiar with extremely old games, uh, you would be, you will be very confused. It definitely does not save you from the oldness of the game. 
it seems to mostly be uh it seems to mostly be like a visual thing please see dms oh hi in file entertainment hello Do I want to give away a couple of keys? Oh, yes, absolutely. Yeah, hi, welcome to the stream. Are you like the actual developer in my stream right now? <laughs> Play does and love Wasteland too, but this is very different. The actual developers. Whoa, well, welcome, thank you for coming. And the answer to that is yes, I would love to do that. Played as a miniature tabletop RPG, graphically speaking. Yeah, I mean, it just it just has a bit of a learning curve as far as old games go. But uh, it seems very solid. I kind of I'm curious about because I have never played the old, the original Wasteland one, so I'm curious. I'm very curious about that now. I assume. Did the did the original one have sound? Or was it just like very simple beeps and boops? <laughs> this probably sounds like a really dumb question. Tell Fargus he owes me fifty dollars. <laughs> Write the star studded stream. This is the second time someone connected to the game has been here. Who else was here? Did I miss something? There were some bleeps and bloops. Oh, okay, great. Well, then this is much improved on the bleeps and bloops. Oh my gosh, okay. All right, so the developer just gave me uh, three keys to give away, Steam keys. So I will do that really quickly, or I will set up a giveaway for that. Let's grab a building. Thank you so much for that. In, in, is it in, in style, in style, in style entertainment? I never know how to pronounce it. There's a PDF of the Wasteland manual. Well, the manual's actually in the game, which I learned, which is like in the help, which is cool. Very nice. In exile. Oh, that makes more sense. That makes way more sense. <laughs> It's just like when I try and read people's Twitch usernames and fail horribly. Okay. So, let's do... Okay, I'm going to switch to this really quick, so just a moment. I wasn't quite prepared to give away a couple games. I think I'll give away, if it's okay with you, uh, in Exile Entertainment. I have also been playing Wasteland 2 the la th this entire month. So I might not have time to give away all three games right now, but I, I could give away one or two today and then uh, the last one tomorrow, if that's okay. Um, giveaway. Oh yeah, for sure, to use as you please. Thank you so much, I greatly appreciate that. That's so nice. Wasteland 1, the remaster. Oops. All right, we'll do this for 30 minutes. Actually, now let's do a short one. Let's do 15 minutes. And we'll do the same dealio as usual. It must be a follower to join the giveaway. Subscribers get a bonus chance to win. And uh, here we go. Waiting on Wasteland 3. Oh my god, I'm so excited about Wasteland 3. So excited. Okay. 
giveaway should be going. If you guys want to win a copy of this game on Steam, uh, is it working? Should be working. Hello, cheese bot. Get with the program. There we go. Okay, exclamation point win cheese to join if you'd like to win a copy. Thank you so much again in Exile Entertainment. Yay! Okay, we'll let that go. 15 minutes. And then I'll pick a winner. All right, this place looks slightly different than the last place. The walls in this room are covered with graffiti. Some blood. Mutant rats have no guts. Look at them run away. I have a bunch of stupid, wimpy rats. What a bunch of losers. Wow, there's a lot of crap in here. Ouch. There was once a door here, but the garbage in this room is knee deep and it feels like it's moving. Am I gonna get attacked? There is nothing special. Are you sure? Okay. Looks like it stinks in there. More garbage. The door opens. What's that symbol? I love how you can just face plant into all the walls. <laughs> ah! Crunch? Well, that's one less mutant turtle in the world. Oh, turtle? Oh no, I don't want to kill a turtle. That's so sad. Oh, the game is not even on the screen. I'm so sorry. Nothing happened, you guys. Don't worry, nothing happened. I just ran into some walls and it's crushed a mutant turtle. <laughs> to carpet build are these all gonna be the same was it a teenager who was also a ninja I hope not I mean actually that would make it a little bit better yeah if I squished a teenager turtle that would be better than like a baby turtle Kill the heroes in the half shell. Turtle power. How is it so far? You know, um, I'm learning. I'm learning about this game. That is my current opinion. <laughs> uh, we don't need any heals. But no, it's a. It seems like it's a really good solid RPG. It's just uh, whoa. Really, it's very difficult. It's very um. It's very retro. I'm not sure how to explain it to people without sounding, without making it sound bad because, you know, it's like, it's just difficult to learn. So if you're not familiar with old games like this, then uh, you might have a little bit of a hard time. Like, I'm really glad that I played this on stream because Basically, I would not get- I would not have gotten anywhere if I didn't have chat's help pe from people that are, um, you know, familiar with the game and stuff. But, the manual for the game is in the game, and that's really helpful, so if you need to look stuff up and whatnot. God, Helga cannot get any experience. <laughs> I'm a little worried about that. An abandoned building. From 1988, it's an old game. This is how games were. You seem to have a little patience. Oh, I play tons of old games. I would say that I do have patience. I would say that. I've never played, um, I mean, I've played games this old, but I've never played this style of of old game before. So this is a learning experience for me, for sure. Ow! <laughs> oh, should I go in the sewers? 
Sure, why not? Oh, it's just like a fast travel thing. Cool. You crawl through the slimy underground. This manhole leads. West. Wow. Cool. Okay, what's this building? Stagecoach Inn. Oh, cool. You were born in 1988? Nice. <laughs> Go to the bar first, the shop second, or you will have an abandoned mine experience. <laughs> Okay, what about the inn? You didn't mention the inn. We need to get into the mindset of the time. The 80s, even the late 80s, were a very different era for video games than the usual retro stuff from the 90s. Yes. No vacancy. The inn should be okay, just don't drown. How am I supposed to drown in an inn? What is this? Mule foot rushes at you. I worked for ugly. I don't have to take that. What? <laughs> I'm sorry. Did I offend you somehow? Who the hell is ugly? I mean, other than you. <laughs> I work for ugly. Okay. Um... The sign on the saloon door says Cookies Chuck Wagon. Oh my god, this music is awesome! Holy crap! Hello? Please don't kill me. I don't know who Ugly is, but I don't want anything to do with him. The thugs pull guns. We don't like people hanging around our table. <laughs> Blow off. Blow off? Who says that? What, are you, like, from the 80s or something, dude? <laughs> Did people even say that in the 80s? I've never heard that before. Blow off. Thank you so much, in Exile Entertainment. Thank you for stopping by the stream and for being awesome and creating really cool games that I love. Thank you so much. And also, thank you for the game keys to give away. Enjoy your flight. Good luck. <laughs> All right. Blar. Well, it's, uh, it's a sad life when all we can do is just kill everyone. Whoa, the floor is slippery with grease. Oh, sorry, dude. I didn't even need to spill your, your butter everywhere. Am I? What's going on? Okay, I'm just going to steal your stuff then. Okay? An old cook shakes a spoon at you. I told you to stay out of here. Well, clearly, I don't know how to listen to directions. There's a lobby desk with a sleepy local behind it. A wood railing splits the room. Hi. The clerk says, Looking for info or a room? Wow, he's very cartoony looking. Info? Rooms cost 50. No charge for that. Okay, then what is it? Info. Room. No, I don't want a room. Uh, Okay, whatever. What? Passkey? Oh! What? Oh, I bought a room. Alright, cool. I'm gonna go to bed then. Number 10. Alright. Not that one. Uh, why is there all really, really angry people in here? <laughs> 18, 19, 20. Everyone's so mad here. Why is everyone so mad? Uh, I don't know where room 10 is. It's right here. Oh. I have to use it. Why is there floating trash in my room? I don't appreciate that. 
I would like to sleep. <laughs> I guess it's just for doing this. Am I right? Stepping in grease all day would sour you too. <laughs> Maybe the room is an asshole. Yes. My room is full of wind. There's too much wind in my room. I wish to switch rooms. Can I have more towels? <laughs> Please. I want a, I want a free night. It would be nice if we could just, you know, rest until healed instead of spamming this. That would be cool. Buying the key was your excuse to get in here and move the plot forward. You're not really ready. Oh. <laughs> okay. Man, I'm just doing everything right, aren't I? It's almost morning. All right, 5.30 a.m., 6 a.m. Good enough. Also, we need to reload. Oops. Uh, that button. No, not you. <sighs> you work at a hotel and that is even, even funny right now. <laughs> Fammy Jack, I worked at hotels for like six years, so I totally know what you mean. I would like a free room because X reason. <laughs> Literally anything works. There was a Tootsie Roll on my bed when I checked in. Free room. Uh, okay. You know what would be cool? You know what would be really cool is if Helga could like kill someone. That would be nice. I'm honestly, I'm honestly like mad that I didn't, uh, oh shit, that I didn't just make everyone a rice lord. I should have done the rice lord one, two, three, and four and just made everyone have huge melee weapons. <laughs> you want a free room because the floor is covered in grease and trash is flying around. See, if, if that happened in real life, I wouldn't be mad to give a free room away. That would be reasonable. <laughs> She got, um, I think I gave her, like, rifles or something. Yeah, I gave her, she's basically a medic and she has one assault rifle skill. So, uh, not great. Back in the 90s, I traveled a lot and was that a-hole that would smoke in a non-smoking room. Oh. They had no more smoking rooms. Not your fault. Totally your fault, Falsinator. I hope you got charged for it. Oh, no offense. <laughs> Only because I was on the opposite side of that many times. <laughs> oh! Helga got 10 experience. Gates are chained and locked. Okay. Well, before we go in, let's go in the front door. Apparently, this is the front door, so. <laughs> Mission added. Free quartz. Okay. Scott's bar is noisy and smoky with many people at tables. To the west is a bar. To the east is a low stage. Everybody stops and looks at you when you enter. Then return to their conversations. You hear people muttering something about a gang taking over town. I'm cool. I'm gonna take out the gang that's taking over town. Cause I'm, we're the rangers, that's why. Drink. That's a table, that's not a drink. I know, a table when I see, this place is gigantic. What is this, like the Elder Scrolls Arena? Oh, wait. Um. Okay. Is this, is this the gang that's taking over town? Um, the 
This is not good. Okay, no, actually, no, it's fine. It's fine, right? Helga, you okay? Helga, get up, Helga! <laughs> All right, giveaway's done! Who will win a copy of Wasteland Remastered? Given to us directly by the one and only in Exile Entertainment, the creators of this very game. Who will win? Herbal Dance, you have won. Congratulations. Congrats, sir. Will you please uh, send me a direct message? Herbal Dance, if you're still there. Hopefully you're still there. Otherwise I'll have to give it to someone else. Speak now or forever hold your cheese. <laughs> Is he gone? They also, they made Torment Tide, Tides of Numenera? Really? Oh. Well, heck yeah. Herbal dance! He's in the chat list. Well, you, you know the rules. You gotta be here. In order to win the game. I'm gonna count down. I'm gonna count down from, from 10. <laughs> from 10. Did he actually go on a coffee break? Because if that's true, then I'll wait. Coffee break is a respected situation on this stream. I thought the rule was we don't talk about rules. I know. Oh, you don't know. Okay. Never mind. All right, we're picking someone else. Sorry, Herbal Dance. Old Khajiit! Are you there, Old Khajiit? Hello? <laughs> I'm gonna dance to this cool music while we wait. By the twin moons. There we go. Okay. Congrats, old Kashit. You have won. Uh, send me a direct message, please, on Discord. Or Twitch, if you'd prefer that. But I think you're in Discord. Are you in Discord? Whichever whichever one you want. Send me a direct message, okay, old Khajiit? I will message you a lovely key. After the stream. All right. I think I need to write this down. I hope I don't. You've never won anything online. Well, now you can no longer say that. No longer say that. All right. Bad. Let's do one more game giveaway. Okay, complete that one. And uh, we'll just do it again. All right, another one is open. Second key, go! Exclamation point win cheese to win. If you'd like to win a copy of Wasteland Remastered. Given to us by the glorious developers themselves. Which is, what an honor, by the way, to have the developers pop into my stream. So cool. That is so awesome. Alright, there goes all the wind cheeses. Correct, this is a, for the Steam version, yes. That would be cool if they were god keys, but unfortunately they're not. Alright, uh, so, Helga's unconscious. What does my quest log say? 
about this stuff that I just figured out. Free quartz! Ruthless gang. What are the desert rangers going to do about it? Oh, is that a challenge game? Is that some kind of weird challenge? What are you going to do about it, player? Are you watching? I'm sitting here. <laughs> I'm sitting here. Sorry. Sorry, sir. I didn't mean to smack you. Magic cookie! Thank you so much for all the bits. Woo! Do, 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 do. Thank you so much, Magic Cookie. That, that's also that's a cool cheer mode thing. That looks fancy. Cheers. Cheers to you, friend. Cheers to you. How are you doing today? The pretty barmaid speeds by. Her name tag says, Hi, I'm Ellen. She only stands still near the bar. Um, Helga. I'm ready for you. Uh, thank you, Penny String Bean. I am ready for you. Thanks so much. Um, I don't know if Helga is ready, though. She seems pretty... She's, like, passed out. Um. Whoa! Oh, boy. You can't sit here. <laughs> okay, sorry. Uh. I can't actually, like... Talk to the barman, so... Hello? All of you can't sit here. Okay. What do you want from me, game? Uh... Ooh, sorry. Ooh, sorry. Ah! Things have been rather nasty in quartz, you're told. One of the larger desert bands, led by a guy called Ugly, <laughs> has taken an intense interest in uh, civic affairs. Normally, a town of our size could drive them off because the bandits don't try all that hard when attacking. But this time, they hit us with a vengeance. It's almost like they don't want to remain in the desert. Okay. This time, they hit us with a vengeance. It's almost like they don't want to remain in the desert. Magic Cookie is gifted a sub to War Ride. Welcome, War Ride, to the Cheesy Horde. Thank you so much, Magic Cookie. So kind, very kind. Magic Cookie's that kind of guy. He's like, he's got kindness shooting out his ears. Ooh, and cheese apparently too, yes. Sorry, I just hit my microphone. Hopefully that wasn't loud. <laughs> Ooh, Helga's alive again. Okay, great. Let's, let's quick save. All right, so am I just like talking to people then? Is that what I'm trying to do? I don't know why I got that cutscene, but ooh, look at this. That person wants to murder me. Oh, the moment you set foot on stage, some of the dancers run off screaming. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Probably gonna reload, but this is really funny that you can just walk on stage and get it. We're just gonna reload. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to press forward. I thought it would stop me. <laughs> this game has too much freedom for the likes of me. <laughs> nice dancing, ladies. Does anyone else want to tell me about stuff? Head crusher, or er, er, Okay, hello. Well, oh, hello there. Bunkers. New waiver. Oh, you wanna go, bro? You wanna go? Bring it on. Think you're so, you think you're so new wave? I'll show you what, what a new wave is. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, ow, maybe I won't. <laughs> oh wait, maybe I will. Maybe it's fine. Yeah, it's fine, we're doing good. We're doing good, see? We're gonna win. <laughs> yeah. Helga, kill someone, Helga! They're just punkers. They're just punkers with knives. Oh, <gasps> she killed someone! Yay! All we have to do is attack civilians and Helga can kill people. Oh, yeah. 38 experience. 
Oh yeah, Helga's moving up in the world. That's <laughs> Thank you so much, Magic Cookie. Helga is here. She is here in in spirit and in reality. Ooh, loot. Hey, forty six dollarinos. You get a flash of insight. Their general HQ, probably a hideout, uses a password, Thanatos. Okay, are you, are you guys gonna remember that in chat? Because <laughs> do I have to write it down? <laughs> oh, fine. I'll write it down. This is not the kind of game that remembers that for you. I'd be willing to bet. Thanatos! Yeah. Uh, it's not Caterpillar, you're absolutely right. <laughs> I don't need to use that. Where's my pen? Okay. You heard it as Thin Doritos? <laughs> Than, uh Okay, hideout. It's probably a different place than the railroad, I would guess. Wham! Smack into the wall behind you. Someone mutters about the drunks they let into this place. <laughs> hey, look at that crazy bunch of kooky people over there smacking their faces into the walls. <laughs> they used to have thin Doritos? Oh, really? That was a thing? You know, I feel like you need to go rest. Is there anything else to be learned from in here? Or are we good? Beer. Oh, those guys want to die. They do. They do indeed. Those are the people that kicked my ass before, though. So maybe I should just leave. Whoa! Okay. Punkers. You want to go, punkers? You want to go? Yeah, get him! Yeah! That's right, that's what I thought. Anything over here? Could play some billiards. Alright, let's leave. Did I talk to Head Crusher? No, I didn't. I don't think. I, I mean, I talked to... I went to this table, and there was a thing that happened. Like, a cutscene? Was that what I needed to do? Also reload Helga. Oh, yeah. Headcrusher's alone at a table. This guy? Hey! Oh! Oh. Stay off my table. Is it this guy? Hey, watch. Oh. Riddler. His eyes twinkle. Buy me a drink, bucko. Riddles are thirsty work. What is often eaten for breakfast, sometimes eaten at lunch, but usually drunk only at dinner. <laughs> is this one of those things where it's like not food only drunk only at dinner sometimes eating at lunch but usually drunk only at dinner I don't know your mom <laughs> your drunk uncle People going to sleep? Who's going to sleep? Ah, Benny Stringbean! Good night. Good night, sir. <laughs> Yo, mom. <laughs> Anybody know? I can't really think of anything that it would be. Eating for breakfast. Grits. Toast. Mm. Ham. I feel like it's a trick, like it's a trick thing. Like, is there, a, is there a 
food that you eat for breakfast that's also something else. That's like a person. Tomato juice. Toast? Toast? What? How, how does toast make any sense? Oh, like a toast, like, oh. Oh, ha! <laughs> I get it. Good job, chat, you're all so smart. <laughs> so we have another riddle, yeah, sure. What is found in the center of both America and Australia? What do you mean? Outback Steakhouse? <laughs> this one is very easy. Is it? Trees. Water. Oh, it's a word. Oh, oh, I see. Okay. R. This is I always overthink this shit. That's why I'm so bad at these stupid riddles. <laughs> oh, okay, let's do one more. Last riddle, he says, but important. In just eight letters, how do you compliment the barmaid? You're a butlin? You're a beauty Ellen. Really? How would you ever get that? Oh, is that written on the wall or something? Like this? You're a butlin? <laughs> That's so obscure. Absolutely correct, he chortles. Tell her so and your work will become easier. He thanks you for the drinks and leaves. Okay. All right. <laughs> Hello, are you the guy I need to talk to? Hello? Mission updated, free courts. You overheard enough to realize the townspeople are concerned about a mayor and other hostages held by the gang. Hmm, where have I, where have we encountered this exact situation recently? I can't quite put my finger on it. I feel like something happened very recently where there was raiders and also, oops, a, a mayor who was indeed captured. <laughs> Blar, yar, blar, blar. Okay, Helga is unconscious again, but it's fine. Jabbed. Damn it, Brad. Those are the only stuff you actually recall, really. That's funny. I. You're worse than the Thugs and Uglies gang. I'm not it. What? Hello? Oh, I found him! Okay. Is Helga gonna come back to life? <laughs> Hello? Stay off the tables. I'm sitting down. I am sitting down. What do you want from me? This is how I sit. Don't jump. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, the credit card. Oh, right. Yes. Okay. Sorry. I'm, yeah. Uh, items. Visa card.
It's not working. He invites me to sit down. How do I... Um... Do I... Maybe I use it at the chair? Head Crusher says, you thank you. Go you're to the you're Atchison's welcome. tent and tell them Caterpillar. Caterpillar! Uh, I can talk to him. Um, what should I ask him about? Real nomads. I'd sure love to chat, but that topic bores me, he says, and drinks his cloudy drink. Sitting here is a man looking... Oh, okay. Um, what about uh, snake squeezins? Can we ask about the card? Visa card. You know what, Head Crusher? I've had enough of you. Is Helga going to wake up? I'm worried. Hello? Quit pushing Ranger! Is this- is this the... I just have to hang out here? How do I talk to her? Is that her right there? Oh! There's so many aggressive people in here! Oh my god, we need to heal so badly. to the doctor. I need to go to the doctor now. Okay. Um, I assume I have to pass time. I guess I'll just move back and forth. I might have to reload. Yeah, seriously wounded is what it means. There's nothing to not talk. Disband one character into the bar stool. Oh. Rice Lord is unconscious. Okay, Brad. <laughs> oh. Oh. What, did, what was the thing again that I have to say to her? You, you're, you're, you beauty, bleh. <laughs> you're a, you're a beaut, Olin. She grins broadly. You're a cutie too and trustworthy to boot, I bet. Take my room key, stage coach 18. You'll know what to do. Okay, thank you. Cool, okay. Um, so can I get out of here is the question dying because I would love I would love to go to the doctor <laughs> I would really love to go to the doctor now where's the doctor hey rice lord's alive again uh I, I'm pretty sure there was a doctor Somewhere, wasn't there? No. Uh oh, Gomez is gonna. Do is this it? Please. Oh, okay. Gomez. Exam. You don't have enough money. Oh, wow. Just share the money, you ding dings. Right, it's fine. Um, uh, 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 how do I give right? How do I give him some money? Flip. Divide. Okay, there we go. Gomez. Heal. Heal one point.
You need to heal a lot more points. Are you serious? Okay, now he's just unconscious. Okay, is he gonna be okay now? <laughs> Holy crap. Um, four, uh... You didn't help, Gomez. There we go. He's gonna be fine. He's gonna be fine. Okay. We're, we need to go rest now. Real bad. Well, Gomez passed out again. <laughs> or he didn't. I guess he never woke up. All right. You better, you better finish these guys off quick. You better do it. Here we go. All right. Duh! Let's see. Where was the sleepy time house? Ow! Oh. <laughs> we all just went unconscious for running into that cactus. Where is the... Oh, God. No, it wasn't this. Where's the, 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 the freaking hotel? Is it that? Oh. oh, hey, it's a shop. Hello. What have you got? A, a flamethrower? Wow, that's fancy. Oh my god, he's got a rifle. Snake squeezins! Did he want two snake squeezins? The guy from the uh, the railroad thing? Did he want two of them? I seem to remember two. I want this rifle. He didn't specify an amount? Okay, let's just get, let's buy one. We have 297. We can't afford it. Uh, sell. Fruit. Fruit, 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 fruit. Now we can afford it. But I don't think uh, I probably won't be able to buy much ammo for it, though. Yes, uh, Brad has rifle skill. Brad has a lot of rifle skill. Helga has one assault rifle skill. God, this music's so good. <laughs> I like it. Okay, so. Should I do this? Uh, well, these are. Oh wait, is an M seventeen? Is that also a rifle? It's cheaper. I should probably look this up. Uh. weapons. Is it a medium range weapon? It doesn't have a scope on it or anything. Yeah, okay. M19 is a single shot weapon firing 8 shot clip of 7.62. M17 is a lighter short barreled version of the M19. It's 10 shot clip of 6.72 ammo. Gives a faster fire rate 
than its big brother, but the barrel length makes it slightly less accurate at maximum range. Okay, it sounds like it's worth getting the M19 then. Faux show. What is the hand mirror? I don't know. I was wondering that too. Everyone started with, uh, with a hand mirror. I'm going to buy Brad the M19. Why not, right? He's supposed to be our sniper. Oh, I can't. I thought I had enough. I guess I don't have enough. Oh well, we'll have to come back. That's cool. That's cool that that's there. Pooled money is on a different character. Didn't I? But I did pool it. Yeah. It's 239 pooled. I thought I had more, but... Oh my god, I think I know what I did. Oh god, if you hit A or D, you you buy the thing that you're... Oh shit. <laughs> I think I just bought something on accident, that was why. Alright, hold on. Uh, Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know that A and D was also like a select. Okay. Do we have to do this again? Well, what the hell did I buy? <laughs> I know I bought a snake squeeze in, but I... No, I did buy it. Okay. Okay. No, it's... We're fine. We're fine. All right. Yep. Yeah, we're fine. I think. Right? And I need some clips. I think we're good. You're not, you're not Brad. Wait. Oh God, Brad's at number one again. All right, equip that. Oh, it's already got ammo in it. Okay, no. And we'll, we'll keep this other ammo, I guess. Upgrade. Let's see how we do. Wow. Go Helga, I guess. Central is like negative seven. Yeah, negative six. Give it to Helga, she's out again. All right, um, so I need to remember where the hotel is. Where the heck was, ah! shooting some dudes. Must have been up north, right? Must have been. Is it over here? Oh. So many evil people around! It wasn't that. I know it wasn't that. It was in this area, right? Am I crazy? Was it here? No. We need 
to buy some smelling salts? Yeah, no kidding. What is this? The courthouse? No. Does, any rem does anyone remember where the um, the inn the inn was? Center of town, gray building. Okay, thank you. Please don't, please don't kill one of my dudes. I would appreciate it. Run south, north to south. Runs north to south. Gunsels? What's a gunsel? with God. Brad, stop being unconscious. Oh. There it is. It's a weird brown building. Okay. Uh, so our room is over here. Can we still go in it? Okay, good. <laughs> Thank God. Ah. We'll sit here for a while. Good night, War Ride. Oh, wait. I gotta pick. Did I not pick the winner yet? Okay. Wait, wait. Don't go yet, War Ride, just in case. <laughs> Silverleaf wins. Okay, Sarah. Sorry, never mind. I wouldn't want you to miss that, just in case. Silverleaf, you're the winner of the second raffle. Congratulations. Woohoo. Okay, Silverleaf. You know the drill. Send me a message and whatnot. You know. You know how it goes. I'm gonna have to stop streaming soon, uh, guys, just so you know. But this is getting more and more, more and more fun as we go along, for sure. Things are actually happening, <laughs> which helps. Twelve-hour Pringles. Mm, Pringles. <laughs> you brought Pringles. Oh no! Come on, one more life. There we go. All right. So tomorrow, tomorrow is gonna be a little different stream-wise because I have some um, like wedding stuff to do during the day. So I might do a short stream later, like when I get home. However, it's a little complicated because I got a call from the vet and I they said I can also pick up Bella tomorrow. So that means I have to go get I have to go buy a couple of things before I bring her home and I have to run a bunch of errands during the day and do wedding stuff. So hopefully I have time to stream when I get back do we, after doing all of that. I will never learn new skills if I don't invest IQ. Oh, we should try leveling up. Um, Gomez. All right. But, but yeah, so tomorrow is a bit iffy is what I'm trying to say. Tomorrow's a teensy bit iffy. But if I don't get to stream tomorrow, then I will for sure stream, you know, again on Thursday. And, uh, we'll maybe play some of this and some of Wasteland 2. Or, or just waste, I don't know, it depends on what I feel like, I guess. But, um, I will definitely give away the last key next time I stream. Uh, so I have to invest... In, in this, in order to get new skill points? Is that what you're saying? Okay. Does Gomez need more stuff? I guess I'll do it. Should I just do it for everyone? I guess he was the only one. <laughs> Alright, before we stop though, let's uh, go to 18. Because we have a key for that. From our... Lovely friend lady. The store is locked. Did 
Brad get that? Oh, well hell. You startle a woman in a wheelchair. Hi, I'm Lori, she says. My mom, Ellen, said you would come by. So I can be sure you're okay. Tell me what you said to my mom or what she said to you. Do I say you're a beaut again? What do I say to this lady? This is getting interesting. <laughs> yeah, it is. You're a beaut. You're a beaut. You're a beaut. You're all okay. We must be careful. I am sure you will free our town. This is what. Take what is on the table. It will help you free our town. Okay. The hostages are on the third floor of the courthouse. A back stairway goes up from the first floor. The stairs are in the file room. The doors are steel and they are not and they are not heavily protected. Okay. Am I writing this in my journal or should I write this down? She looks too much like her mother. <laughs> yeah. She looks like Helga. The wizardry ain't Helga. Does she? Okay. Third floor. Stairs. Uh huh. Back stairs. The stairs in the file room. The doors are steel and they are not heavily protected. Does that just mean that I can unlock them? I'm not sure. Okay, thanks. You have learned that the password into the courthouse is muerte. Which means death, right? Thank you. Ooh. <gasps> Money. These, pis these are the pistols that Helga has, right? Grenades. Manglers. Who are manglers? AT weapons? The game came at a time when you were supposed to have a notebook. Yes, indeed. You were hoping for the password to Ellen's heart. <laughs> okay. Anti tank. Oh. Oh, right. Yeah, those are in Wasteland too. Yeah, okay. Yeah, well, that's great. Alright, cool. Um, yeah. Big boom booms. Okay, um, items 45. <clears throat> I'm gonna give Gomez one of those. I guess. I really think he should have the manglers though. Nine millimeter clip. trade to Brad, I guess? I don't know. Yeah. Rice Lord, why do you have your fists equipped? That's not cool. What happened to what happened to my mace? Or my club? Did it break or something? What gives? Huh. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Uh, you need to reload. And you need to reload. Go. Lori spins her wheelchair and says, Good luck. I won't be here if you return. Oh. 
Oh my god, and she just phases into oblivion. Oh, well that was very helpful. <laughs> she had a rocket chair. I guess she did. <laughs> I guess she did. Alright, cool. Ah! Ooh! <laughs> That's how I drowned here. Okay, I get it. <laughs> Alright, save. All right, so next time we go to the courthouse. What, okay, wait, Thanatos, what, what password was Thanatos for? I'm gonna write this down. Was that the like raider uh, gang password? And then Caterpillar was the railroad. Nomads. Where is the courthouse password? Thanatos is the boss. Where is the password? Oh, that's just a guy. Okay, thought it was another password. <laughs> Thank you, Elf Elfiend. Might as well get rid of the pistols I'm not using. Yeah, I should sell them, right? We. Oh, I can hear me. Love is so true. All right, I'm gonna go to vendor some stuff and put, excuse me. There it is. Okay. Oh boy. Something's uh, a little glitchy with the fighting here. It's okay though. It's nighttime. It's extra dangerous around here. Alrighty then. Uh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Here, there we go. Rice Lord, sell. I think I'm gonna keep the one pistol on him since he doesn't have one, right? Seems like a good idea. Uh, I think. <laughs> I think. I don't know. Sell. Gomez. Uh, the 45 pistol's better than the 9mm, right? Or, does, or are they both the same? Should I sell the 9mm? Because, I mean, Gomez isn't actually using it, but... Who is from your old team, guessing Lipple or Max? Oh, are you also from uh, In Exile Entertainment, Femesto? Hello. 45 hits harder, runs out of ammo faster. Well, I like... Uh, do I like that? But we already have so much nine millimeter, you know? I'm just gonna, no, I'm just gonna sell that one because we already have ammo for this one, so screw it. All right, Helga, sell uh, one of those. And then sell that, and you're good. You can sell your pistol and your clips. buy more of these. Okay. Okay. Should I buy should I buy the carbine? Or does it not matter? Should I buy a car? I could give that to Helga. But she has a assault rifle skill, so maybe it would be kind of a stupid investment to do that. Fim Fimsetto was a former producer that came earlier at the start of the stream. 
Oh my god, I didn't even know that you were here. I'm so sorry, Fibsetto. <laughs> you were in an exile at a different company now, but you were a producer in the title, so I'm a proud papa today. Oh, well that's so cool. Welcome. I'm sorry I missed you in the beginning. I didn't mean to do that. Poor investment. If you lack the skill, you'll basically never hit. Okay. Fabulous. What about what about buying leather jackets? Is that a good thing to do? Let's see, we've got seven hundred dollarinos. So I could buy a few of them. Would that be is that is that gonna help me live? I will find some eventually. Maybe I should just buy some for like I could get maybe get one for Helga so she doesn't die or We buy leather jackets, maybe the thugs will buy us beers. <laughs> Armor for medic, okay. Helga, buy. But just the jacket, right? Not the vest. Cause that's fix, this is expensive. Let me see if I can. Okay. Items, uh, weapon lists? What about armor? There's no armor. Or is it? Hmm. Does it count as weapons or something? Make sure your team has some kind of armor at least. Leather thugs will steal our leather jackets to replace their blue jean jackets. I'm trying to find where it says the difference between the armors, but maybe I'll just buy the cheaper one for now, I guess. But I don't know. Is this even good? Like, it just says it's a leather jacket. That doesn't seem very good. Bulletproof shirt seems like it's decent. Does this even help? But it's better. Yeah, I know, but like by how much? Do I want to spend all of my money on it right now? That's my that's my question. Leather and jacket is one. Bulletproof shirt, two. Okay. Let's just buy the leather jacket. For Helga. Equips. Aha! Fortunately, I wish that he had an assault rifle for sale, but he doesn't. Oh, AC. Nice. Okay. Could also get one for Brad. And then if I find better ones, I could put it on Reisler and go with Yeah, you know what? You know what? Screw it. Let's get him on the squishies. Oh, did I forget to pull the money? Oh, did I do that? Okay. Must have been what I did. Aha. No! Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I didn't do anything. It's fine. Okay. I thought I bought something on accident, but no, it was fine. Everything's fine. No need to panic. Okay. <laughs> Hooray! Upgrades. It's fine, yes. All right. <laughs> Save. Right, so journal. Oh, hey, look. Wait. It does update my quest log. Aw, that's so nice. Thank you, game. It even tells me the password, so I don't have to remember. I'm assuming this is not in the original game, am I right? 
I, was there even a quest log at all? Probably not. You've been told that several people, including the mayor, have been taken hostage by the game. The town of Quartz has been taken over by a game led by the name, man named Ugly. <laughs> Alright, cool. So we're gonna go up there and kill Ugly and stuff? That, that's what we'll be doing next time. Hopefully I do not forget. Z Storm, Storm, one, two, three. Thanks for following. All right, so uh, definitely the quest by name and quest log. Those are all new additions. Very good additions. Def definitely helpful. A absolutely, very nice. It's pretty hard in these old games to uh, figure out what the heck you're doing. So having a quest log is absolutely amazing. Obviously. Um, no more hugging the cactuses. Well, I'm not making any promises, Alfine, but I'll you know try my best. 